Foot like a bee, Danny Boy here, and welcome back to another episode of Transport Fever 2. Well, minus Nimby Rails. Uh, because we're going to do freight today. Uh, we've got a few things to do. I've added a few things, a couple of uh, stone quarries around Scotland, and I noticed when I was building in Nimby Rails that there's like a, a concrete cement factory. I think it's either between Carlisle and Newcastle, just sort of like south of Edinburgh. But yeah, so we're going to get uh, corn mats made there. This little train is ace. I think it's the best train I've ever built. It's the only one that seems to really work perfectly all the time. Uh, these idiots here are still loading up with fuel. Uh, so is this one. That one's almost done. The fuel for air. And the Scott Rail fuel for Edinburgh is going to take some time. So, over here at air, we've built a stone mine just in the coast there. We'll get some trucks, take it over to here. Uh, we'll unload it. We'll get another combat train, and this one will have to head off to Edinburgh. Uh, sort of past all this stuff. It can join on to this line. And it can go in here. We've got a couple of corn mats, uh, Edinburgh construction over here. I do have another uh, depot over here. Now, this is going to service Berwick upon Tweed and parts of Edinburgh, but anything that's coming from the north is going to come over here and unload there, and then we'll take it. Because I've got a few uh, concrete or stone thingies stone uh, quarries uh, up to the north as well high up in the mountains etc where they really should kind of be uh, that's heading up severely maybe don't head up so severely because shortly yeah, yeah, yeah you're gonna be coming down there we go that's slightly better uh, keep going down there we go don't want any bridges. I sort of just want this to be. I sort of want it to go in there. Uh, can I pull something out here? I can. Maybe go up. Yeah, have you go up a touch? Now we've deleted a few buildings there. That's okay. All in the name of progress. Uh, we'll pause it. No, we'll keep it running. It doesn't frame rates don't seem to be too bad when building anymore, thanks to the new the new update. Now I will need some way to get uh, a truck stop in here. Now I'd like to put it at this side. It's going to create one of those wild, uh, we will push pause actually, wild chunks into the land. Uh, we should probably go freight. Yeah, that would be extremely useful. Where's my, where's my thingy? There's my thingy. Uh, my era. Yes, please and blah 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 we'll make this something else dirt soil gravel 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 would be cool uh, i could possibly use ah we should get a proper well we will get a proper quarry up and running what is going on here why have you chosen madness i was doing something really weird and doesn't want to attach to this section at all, which is odd. Right, zoom in. Or okay, well, it will attach to there. I wanted it to attach to here. Too much slope. No, 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 it's going up. Go down. Oh, it won't go down. Oh, there. Right, there it is. There is the the thing. Oh. Come on, just attach to there. This could be one episode in the making attaching this to something. Now, I am going to want to extend it out a touch as well. Uh, why are you so awkwardly placed? Too much blah 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 blah. Okay, just place it in there. Uh, smooth that out. I mean this is probably going to go when I extend this. Right, go into there. Right, I was going to build a quarry, kind of like this, and make, dig a hole in the land, but that's more of a, 
a high detailing skill with uh, with time and patience. Something we do not currently possess. Uh, let's configure this now. I want that aggregate aggregate cargo loading platform. That would be nice. Can't get one there. Can't get one there either. I can get one over here. Maybe do two. I know the trucks come right to the front. Uh, yeah, see, I can't delete that without deleting the entire the entire module. Okay, get that in there, that in there, that in there, and that in there. Okay. Now, actually, that's kind of cool that it's like the road goes above it. I quite like that, actually. So we will get trucks to come up here and start removing some of this stuff. So this is a road transfer route, so go there. And then I think we can just sort of have them unload at here because why the hell not? Uh, we could maybe build something over here. But I'm just going to have it unload there. That'll be perfect. Now, that is currently down as line something, but it should be... Well, it should be green, for starters, because it's road transfer. That'll be RDT... Air... Stone. Right, excellent. Uh, where's my depot? My depot's actually over here. Now, it won't take anything currently at the moment. Uh, we'll maybe give it one of these tipper trucks. 16, 16 is fine. Uh, we'll maybe get two, at least for the moment. Uh, we could sort of have this as its own sort of branded quarry line. Right, RDT. Air stone. Right, so that, they will go out and do something hopefully now we need another train right so get a new line right so i want to go there and then it wants to head out this way it wants to follow that it wants to possibly bypass this line and i did say before that i was thinking about doing a line off here to join on to that so we could and may well possibly do that right you can go into there now, I'm going to pull up the line individually and see where it actually wants to go. Well, it's going along this way, so that's, like, nice for a start. Right, and it goes along here. Now, both the trains on this line are currently uh, waiting for a full load, right? And while that is not completely catastrophic, we'll remove that, right? Right, now you can't build this line. You can build this line to follow this one. And then perhaps maybe square it in. The problem is, am I going to be able to get... Uh, we'll make this katana raid as well. Now you see that first section of the bridge worked. And it worked really nice. But this train here is also waiting for a full load. Uh, this looks to be potentially... Yeah, see, collision. I didn't think it was going to do the fourth section of the bridge. I had a feeling that these uh, these sections here were going to collide. Okay, so three lines, yes. We could give it its own separate line. It's uh, that is something we could do. But I think what I'll do is I'll remove this, right? And then we'll just try and... What we could do, potentially, maybe. I would like that to come out there somewhere, but I'll maybe have that fold into this line. And maybe if stuff does want to sort of go over to the far side, it can go through that way. Uh, yeah, I'll maybe have it follow this train right here so it's coming in from the freight line 
Now it's crossing over there, which is magical. Uh, we would potentially want this at some stage. Go on the flat. Yep. And then veer around onto there. Have that go across there. Yeah, that's quite a nice, quite a nice little thing. Uh, right, and then it goes round this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's one of our trains, one of the new trains. And then it folds into here. Now, currently, there are a few trains running on this. Which is not a complete disaster. Okay, so pull a section of track out that way. And this is going to be freight line. Uh, go up or go flat, even. That would be nice. And try and connect you. Oh. Right, if I bring that, say, down to there, and then get this in here, that should look smoother. Uh, why, do, why do you not want to play? You're good. You're just being awkward. There we go. And then we can fold this in before these the set of lights up here. Okay, now we are going to need to signal this up. So stop there, stop there. Uh, those two can... Well, I'll place them there and then I'll remove this and that for the moment. Uh, that's all good there. So let's see if we could have something go over that way. I don't know what exactly, but I'm sure we'll think of, think of something. Right, place that there. And then I want this here, that there, that there. And then we're all sort of good. This bit should be done. Okay, now, if I select line one, has it chosen a different approach to? Has it been rethinking its life? It has rethought its life, and it's chosen a much better route. Right, that's perfect. That's really good, actually. Uh, we just want to check that this is coming on, coming in on a different platform, which it is. Right, removeth that. Okay, so now I need to launch it from a depot. And what I think I'll do is I'll try and give the game a chance to actually get some combat stored and I'll launch it from this side because there's tons of space for a for a depot here. And it's going in on left hand line. Okay. So buildings, streets, buildings, depot. There we go, depot. Uh, no, this is road vehicles, so that does not help at all. Right, hello there, non-colliding depot. The king of depots. Right, you go in here. Right, now how much do I want for this? It's a smaller, I think I'll give it something like 150. Pretty much almost definitely. I don't know exactly. This class 25, right? Also known as the Sulzer Type 2 uh, between 1967. But what was it used for? British Rail Class Diesel Locomotives. Was it used for freight? It does 90 miles per hour. That's decent. Uh, rail Freight Construction Sector. So we'll add one of these to begin with, right? Now, cargo, it's going to be bringing stone, basically. There's the sea urchin, yeah. The sea urchin takes stone. What else takes stone? There's the FPA, coal hopper, no, that's 
see we've got a lot of stuff now yeah that's like coal and silver so I think it looks like unbranded what do you take no so there are definitely certain things that will that only like stone this is green I'm so happy that they added this because I don't think you really get these in the UK these gondolas it takes stone but we're not going to use that we've got uh, ha see we've got like unbranded PTA iron ore see these all say iron ore but they can't take stone what's this British Rail OBE wagon could be could be a choice uh, oh look at this thing Take sand oil and car mats. So these are, I'm going to say concrete. These things. 100 miles per hour top speed. Really? Uh, what about you? You also take stuff. Network rail, EWS, unbranded, and rail track. You know what? This takes 20. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 200. And it's only 110 meters long. Right, that's perfect. Buy that. Set it on line 1. Okay, so long. Farewell. Good hunting there. Uh, Right, it's time to pray, people. I don't know why, but for some reason when I buy trains and add them to a line, it's, it takes like really long. I think it's like a modding thing. I mean, before it took really long, uh, but now it takes like really, really long. Like, I'm pretty sure this is going to crash. No. That was extremely strange. That's something I've only seen since the new batch. But by the time I build up another train, right? And then we <laughs> we go to set it on a line. That'll be the video over. So we bought two trains and the 15 minute delay between selecting its line and actually going on it is the end of the video. That's your half an hour, 45 minutes done and dusted. See, that's better. It's a, more, it's a smaller train. We don't have mega huge uh, freight trains in the UK. That's more of an American thing. But this is nice. This will work fine. Now, con mats. Right, Edinburgh doesn't want con mats. Boom. But I'm, I'm assuming over here at Glasgow maybe will. Now you see, this is where you should have. Now I've built a diamond there, so I can't pull that off and go over this way. Well done there, well done. So it's gonna have to come over this way, right? Now you see, this is where I wanted the added line, so I could go in here. In fact, I'm pretty sure that I can still does Glasgow even want con mats? Am I just sort of grasping at straws here? It could be. It is, it is my style. Alright, why have you give, given me that road there? I'm not interested in that road. Okay, where will you actually go be a line? Out to about there. That's weird. Alright, push pause because you're about to break things. Alright, break that and that. Yep, I know, I know. That was the whole point of breaking things. Have that go in there. Have that go. Wait, what? Are you trying to snap to the road again? Could you not snap to the road? That would be extremely useful. Right, don't snap to the road. 
Alright, you go in there. But, I still need this. To come out that way. Oh, that now looks more like... More like a thing. And it should work, right? So there's a freight train pulling up here. Right, this is the mixed one that is taking fuel and stuff to Inverness. It gets about 180 fuel, which is pretty decent. Although this little Glasgow train is is a beast. It just pops in for its full load of 70 and then pops back out. Got 166 there, that's pretty decent. Uh, I've not actually checked in quite some time, right, the oil situation over here. Because the last time I did check it, it was, there was a lot. Yeah, there is a lot. Oh, crud. 331. Well, each one takes like 200 or something, right? Maybe. Where are they? One's probably in here, right? Yeah, one is in here. Right, you took 280. Well done. I could possibly add a fourth on here. And you're going back with 67 of the old fuels there. Okay. Now, the freight station at Glasgow is over this side. So, unloading freight over this bridge is not going to work. The only place this is going to work is for when it goes in Aberdeen. And it can come in here and unload freight. Uh, but we won't be able to unload Glasgow at that side. So that is going to be interesting. Now I might just send it by truck over there. Uh, is it quite a fast route? It might be. In fact, something interesting we could possibly do is send it via ship. Just like right across there. It's not a particularly long journey. And it would save me sending the, the ship in. I mean, it can go along here, right? It can come along and it can join up to this track. Alas, it cannot then go over there. There might be something, some uh, witchcraft we can do by maybe branching it over this way and then trying to join on there. That could be dodgy. It might work. Wait, does Dundee even want comrades? It does, and it's one of its primary primary functions. Aberdeen also wants con mats. What if we take a ridiculous amount of con mats back to Glasgow? Does Glasgow want con mats? It does. 116. Okay. And uh, they also want up at Fort William. Uh, they don't want it open. And everything else we'll have to figure out sort of on our own. So, yeah, Glasgow definitely does want corn mats. Now, we can virtually send the train on the same route. And we can send the Fort William train on the same route. And it just comes up here and then goes over there. Oban doesn't want. Fort William does. Okay. So that's two we can do, but I'd like a lot of car mats down here, and then I'll, I'll potentially send a train off to Dundee. Or we could have the train stop in here, and then go off to, off to Dundee. Or do I do that weird ship thing? I might do that weird ship thing. In fact, no. I want to join up to here. Some way, somehow. Uh, I've just realized that at some point I'm going to have to do that anyway. Okay, I've got a plan. 
So plan is this. Yeah, katanery, no katanery this time. Right, bring you out there. Bring you out here. Right. Keep following that. And then I want you to go down. And I would like it to tunnel. I'm kind of hoping that it will tunnel if I keep going down this way. And then I'm going to bring it out over the side. That is going to be the plan. Okay, we've got a tunnel. And I can maybe even start to bring it up a touch. And then, right, have one line going flat along there. And then around to there. Okay. Bring you out a touch. That's way too close. We're not going to be able to tunnel under there. We'll see. Pop. No, 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 no. Ah. Pop you on here. Okay, so we do have a tunnel. That's bad. Yeah, so I need... I should probably tunnel it this side first. Uh, right, the game is built out here. That's bad. Uh, it's okay, because we're going to be building a section track that goes round past this. And then the game won't be able to, uh, say, tunnel there ever again. I'll bring you out to there. Bring this out to here. But then I do want... This one here. Bring that. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't bring that down. Captain Insano strikes again. I had a master plan there and then I, I totally just ditched the plan instantly. <laughs> Once I actually seen something. Uh, right. So I would like this. Yeah, will you fold out there? Huh? Go with that. Right, because at some point freight is going to have to go down there, right? Keep pulling you round. Yeah, and this left hand side. And then this one here is going to have to go down. Right, we've got tunnel. Tunnel has been achieved. Very nice. And then we'll get it. It's still going down. I'm hoping that it just pops up to there. There we go. Which is in. Okay, so that is now a thing. I mean, I could have kept it running out this side and then built the bridge up. And like quad track this. I think like this will be fine. Now, I might do individual train for Aberdeen. And yeah, because they both need quite a lot. Unless I had a train with a capacity of 300. And then would be able to work that, no problem. Uh, we shall see. Uh, no, it would probably be better pulling this off to here as well. 
Now you've not left yourself any room for a diamond. Oh wait. Oh wow. Oh, the game is being nice to me today. What is going on? That is not normally a thing that happens. Right, stop you there. That train is going along. And it comes along here. It splits off. Right, that's going to have to go. So you go. And then one. That there. That there. And that there. And then it goes around there. Okay. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. Weird water effect. Ugh. How do I get rid of that again? Uh... Raise it up slightly. Tapa tapa tapa. Step it in. <laughs> okay, we got rid of the weird water effect. Uh, is there some there? No. The weird thing is, sea level is down here, right? Where this river is. Yet, we've got floaty bit of water. Mm, maybe. But there would be water all in here. I'm surprised they didn't uh, try and resolve that. It's a weird issue. What would be a lot easier is a, a water removal tool. So just a paintbrush where you can say, right, anywhere there's water, like, bye, see you later, be gone. Uh, I no longer require your services. Don't call us, we'll call you, sort of thing. Uh, right. This should be getting stone. Uh, the train is on its way for stone. I should really be setting up another stone line. So that we get tons of stone coming in. But one of the things as you're going to see here is that one of the stone lines is... What's that? It's a forest. Try not to build a stone quarry over here. Uh, give me industries. Okay, so there's one there. Yay. Those are oil rigs. Yay. There's one over here. Glasgow quarry. Ah, I see. Yeah, so there's one up here. And then we'll bring it down to this road. And then I don't know where we're going to load the com mats for this. Possibly... I would say in this one, one would imagine. And uh, the game is built out here again. I don't know why. I'd like them to disappear. Go away. This is highway. Now, all the, I know you do get certain little towns that are just off of motorways and highways and stuff, but not here. Uh, check this. Yeah, it's mine. I own it. There should be nobody building anything on the side of there. Someone did mention that I should probably use uh, barriers and fences, which is a great idea. Also, by building tracks next to stuff the AI can't build. I don't know if it works the same with trees, but placing fence and barrier is like extremely finicky. It's uh, and if you don't do it properly, it just looks like a horrible mess. Now that takes time. And uh, time is a severe luxury at the moment. If, ever, if the game mechanics just worked as the... As God intended them to, it would be magical. Alas, they don't. Right, I need... Don't do that. Yeah, make it a huge, obnoxious valley up into the mountain there. That's the wrong one. This is the right one. Get us. Ooh. <laughs> this is gonna look stupid. Everything I build looks stupid, so it's, it's okay. You go in there, that's that's kinda wild. 
It's really wild. Oh well. Uh, and it's going to be wilder. Right, let's extend this out. Passenger cargo. You please? No. You please? Yep. Yeah. One, two, three, four. Standard. One, two, three, four. Excellent. Now, let's try and smooth some of this out. See, it doesn't look too bad once it's smoothed out. It doesn't look too bad at all. Uh, right, so trucks are going to come in here. And then they're going to head out this way. And they're probably going to go like through and under this tunnel. And then out to there, where they're going to unload stuff out to here. Okay, maybe just do like a, a drop-off. Or somewhere that looks appropriate for dropping off quarried stone. What looks appropriate for doing one of these things? Yeah, I'd like it to go... Oh, actually, we'll go in there. It is relatively connected up to the station. Right, a few buildings will be destroyed. That's fine. Uh, and if we give it a fence, or it's got a fence. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right, and it is connected to that. So that's sweet. Okay, let's get our quarried stone line on the go. Uh, I need to rename that train line that's just currently down as line one. You're going to go there. It does want to go in under the tunnel. We will rename that as green. And we shall do RDT stone or Glasgow stone. Glass stone. Alright, that's excellent. And this is well, paint it orange to start with because it's a freight line. And then we'll go real freight stone. Yeah. Air to Eden. Right. So that is that. Now, uh, the depot for vehicles is right here. That's perfect. Cargo. Uh, we used a couple of these two over there. We could use the with Kipper trailer. Don't know what that means. US Express. Probably not. Uh, the Rungan trailer. Tanker trailer. Kipper trailer. Uh, we've got the screw fix truck. By the way, I think there's a tippers in here. Right, that is right. So we'll use that by, and then we'll use this one as well by, and then we'll set them on a line. We'll set their maintenance for high, apply, set you on RDT, Glasgow Stone. Off they go. What do they actually look like? Uh, Schmitz. Land bull. Well, you can't really see it in that one. You can't see it in this one. Cargo bull. Which is apparently an elephant. I would have thought it would have been a bull. There's a train. Hello, freight liner. This is cool, though. Off they go. There's another train. Trans Benign. Oh, this is nice. While the truck goes underground, we can sort of stay above ground. That's cool. Uh, auto save is in effect. Well done, the auto save. Right. We, however, need to do something. Right, you are unloading oil. Good for you. Little Glasgow train is working as intended. Excellent. Make sure fuel isn't piling up over here. No, zero. 
Uh, this one is zero. Did this one get any? No, zero. But it did, it is making money, which is odd. This little roundabout works really well, and everybody has encroached on me. My headquarters. Can I get a road? That just pops out in there. Oh, look. No. Go away, building. It's mine. <laughs> There we go. Why have you not growing? Probably because we're minus money. Money needs to go up before it starts to grow. I think. Are you on Sage Transport? No, no. It's not, it's not, it's not going to be the name. Right, we need to get uh, from here a train. Yes. To take stone. Okay, now, either use that line, I might use that line, I might use this one, right, I can see here that there was that catenary all the way, and uh, there kind of should be, we'll leave that as diesel, because we'll say that's lines that come from the north. Uh, uh, yeah, from the north, but we'll have the southern line. Have it right. That can go up this way and go that way, but then it can't get over to this side. Well, it can, but it has to pass through these idiots here, which one would imagine takes some time to load up with stuff. Fuel for Edinburgh. I feel like you should be getting more fuel. There's the freight train though. This one. It has picked up 40 stone previously, which is nice. I then need to figure out how to get stone out of here. Now this can only come down there, you see? That was that was perhaps a rookie mistake. Now, if I push this further out, I could maybe get my single track in there. Alright, hold the fort. We'll try this. Tannery, yes. Let's attempt. Something here. Right, we've already got that bit into there. Alright, and then I want to pull this over here. And I want that to go into there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Alright. I want, well, I sort of need this, right? Where does it go flat? See, it doesn't really go flat at all. So that's the third line coming in, right? And then it goes into there. And then I sort of need, want that to like go over onto this section, which looks dodgy. Oh, whoa. So I'm going to have to like pull that out to there. Pull that out to there. Then pull this out to here. Which looks really weird. 
but then again right this train here will only be going up and down in this section of track and we don't really want it to do that at some point we'd like it to cross over to the other section so I'm gonna delete all this which is gonna be a massive pain in fact what you should have done is made life easier for yourself and pulled it into this section why did you not do that who knows what was going on in my brain there Uh, you're gonna have to rework the signals because you've now sort of screwed them up. Okay. Bring that down to there. And bring that down to there. Uh, yep. Give me that. Yeah, so you there. That one can't go there. I need another one there. I'm going to need one there, one on this side, and one on that side. Right, now hopefully the air stone train hasn't completely screwed up. No, no, it's fine. It is fine. Okay, and then we can use this here, right? So grab that. New line. Go from there, right? then go out to here now again this is just a drop off so it's totally fine uh, we'll pull that up we'll get line one yeah we'll have a look bound this way do you use the little single track uh, no it doesn't it is using it per se but I think I need to double slot switch this Aha, right there we go. So this will be a single stone train. Now I would actually like it to go nut on the side where the Inverness train is there. I'd like it to go on that side, so I might have to double slip switch that as well so that it can bypass that. Yeah, I kind of need you to go on this side. Because uh, that train is going to hold it up. Now I could move this train on a different platform. Okay. Uh, you come in to... Perth on 5. Alright, push play. Right, the fuel is transferred over. And then the train can sit on that side hopefully which fuel do you actually carry 112 no one's got 72 yeah, yeah 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 see that works that works okay we can now get a train to be launched onto this as well, which is fine. Uh, buy a train, we'll go a diesel again, or do we go an electric? Do we need an electric? We possibly could, it would be nice to sort of mix it up. I mean, we've got some older ones in here. Mm, I think we've already used a rail freight. Uh, rail freight distribution, also rail freight distribution. We're sort of looking for a construction sector one. Malcolm Rail could be interesting. DB Cargo. Scott Rail maybe. Yeah, I think a lot of this Scott Rail one. Why? I mean, we've added the Scott Rail one for this. We could do a Balfour BE, which I might do. And I think they added like the Biffa one as well. I think Biffa Steel. 
Possibly. Uh, but yeah, where's where are you? Give me you. Scott Rail is in here somewhere. There it is. So on that cargo. Okay, not that. Could take these again. Sixty miles per hour is a bit slow. Let's try and push the boat out in this one. Seventy-five. British Rail BA wagon. What do you take? Stuff. You also take stuff. <laughs> uh, the sea urchins. I think the sea urchins would be pretty cool. 100 miles per hour, right? We have a winner, right? Go one, one, two, one, two, three, four, one, two, one, one. Uh, capacity of 132 1 to 156 by that set it on a line should, oh is it line 1 I think it is sure it is alright and then to bring it to the end of the episode we'll have a 50 minute wait uh, for the train to appear into existence that one was shorter that's nice. Well done, train. How do you... Oh, this is first Scott Rail. Well, you're now first freight Scott Rail. Now, let's look at the sea urchin wagons. So, ZCA, is that like the code? Must be the code. Sea urchin. <coughs> oh, that's EWS. Well, I suppose we are in Scotland. England, Wales, Scotland. And then just sort of standard ones. Yeah, it's a sort of mixed freight one. Right, we'll jump on this train as it goes along its merry way. And we shall wrap it up there. Uh, in the next episode, we'll do freight again because it's taken me a long time to build all the way down from Newcastle upon the Tyne to. Uh, oh, where am I just now? Uh, I think I'm at Durham and I'm like halfway between Durham and Darlington on the NIMBY Rails map. It takes ages to build lines all the way down there. Now it's fine if there's the prominent marks on the map where you can actually see where the line goes but when that's not there ooh, it's painstaking. <laughs> it really is. Uh, right, so this thing might be doing just 75 or something because that's maybe all the line is cut for. But it's pretty cool. I like it. I wonder how the other train is getting on. We'll see that in, uh, in just a second. Yeah, 75. I think it might speed up perhaps later. Maybe. It's down to 73. Crossing over the junction there and it's one way system. Up over, there's the DB Schenker train. Uh, there's no sign of that other diesel, uh, the stone train. I wonder where it is. Boston Transit, probably. Yeah, now this works out really well. So all the trains are at the right hand side and this train just cruises through on its own on the left. Now it may cause a conflict later if that class 37 perhaps maybe gets in the way. <coughs> it's only a teeny tiny little area that it has to really deal with so I'm kind of hoping it's going to be okay right so this thing oh excuse me <laughs> that was a huge yawn I don't know why I've been so tired recently I have been doing stuff uh, for my my previous uh, employer they've been sending me stuff through to do on the computer at home like engineering drawings and stuff and I have been up 
working really late on them. That's why the videos are a bit sporadic now. It should be uh, Anu Transport Fever one day, and then Workers and Resources Soviet Republic and Transport Fever uh, the next day. And it should be going like that, 12 o'clock and 8 o'clock, but it's not because I've been so busy doing this stuff. I can't render anything while I'm working on the drawings in the background because it just uses too much. Uh, it's too much work for the computer to do it once. If I had the new computer, it would be ace, but I don't. So yeah, it's been it's been tough going, but we're getting there. Uh, it won't take me long. They only they gave me like a deadline of like two weeks to do something that a team of like eight people would do in like four months. But I've been sort of flying through it and they're happy with the work I've done so far, so that's that's good. But that's why the videos have been sporadic as of late. Uh, and that's why I've not really built that far in NIMBY rails. Because uh, I've been super busy doing something else. Got to keep a, some sort of cash flow coming in, so that's nice. Right, you're going to stop. Uh, it looks like this one didn't get too much stone. Uh, we'll quickly go and check that. It may be... That I might need to add one or two more trucks to. Oh, actually. One or two more trucks is a slight understatement. Uh, you know what? Since air is a hip and happening place, is it? I've not been there in many, many years, but we'll add two of these. Capacity of 30. That's a hell of a lot better. I don't know why the electric variant, I suppose the Kipper trailer, is uh, slightly more robust. It's got more capacity. But yeah, we'll set that in there. But we'll leave it there for that episode. Uh, as always, if you did watch this and you would like to leave a like, comment, or dislike, please feel free to do so. And if there is more you would like to see in the future, and then hit the subscribe button. I've been Danny Boy. This has been Transport Fever 2 on the UK map. And I will catch us later.